Hello, welcome to DP Tutorials. In this tutorial, let's learn about project codes in Primera. Using project codes, you can organize the projects in the EPS Enterprise Project Structure in groups according to specific categories such as location, division, etc. Using project goals, we can arrange the projects hierarchically based on the category you require. By default, it will be these projects will be arranged in EPS by the EPS codes. Now, in this tutorial, let's see all about how to set up project goals, assign them to the projects, and using these project goals to organize your layouts. Project goals are set up in Project Goals Dictionary, which is available to the entire organization. You can create values for the predefined codes or you can create new project codes and values for use within your projects. And let's see how to assign them using the code family project details in detail. Now let's see how to define the project codes. First, go to this menu bar and click on this enterprise and select this project codes right here. So by default, these are my project codes and if I select one, this will be my project code values and this will be code descriptions now click modify in the project codes dialog box and then define the project code definitions these are project code definitions as per your need to add values to the project code click close in this project code dialog definitions dialog box in the project codes dialog box select the project code right from this drop down menu from which you want to establish values then select in the first one and then click add and type a value. Let's assume a sample. Then click add and type the values and the descriptions right here. To change a code value's position in the project codes hierarchy, select this word and then click appropriate arrow buttons from this command bar. Delete this or cut paste, you can use these buttons by right deleting this one and close this. If you would like to see chart view. You can see this you can even customize this using this box chat box template and you can click on this customize button and you can change the display as for your requirement let's go to the table we know and there's even other called uh, weighted project codes weighted project codes enable you to rank or prioritize projects using a weight value and then view projects by the score this will be used in uh, priority projects to add a weight to your project code in this project codes window enter a value by going to this columns and selecting the weight and enter a value here in the weight column by this you can add weight to this different code values in the project codes now close this now let's see how to assign project code values to the projects in this projects window select a project i'm selecting this one now as we are seeing the details tab here in the details tab here you can go to this codes tab then click assign here so this project has been assigned by these four codes. If you would like to add some more code to the particular project, I can click on this assign and I can select the different code and description. Any particular code, and I can click this button to assign and click this button to close the assign project codes dialog box. When I'm finished, I'll be closing this. So, this is my project window now. So, this is how we assign the codes to the projects. Now, let's see how to prove filter by project codes. Click the display options bar, right click and go to this group on sort by and these are my default project codes which we have seen in the project codes dialog box. Now use this to group and sort by project codes or you can even customize this by clicking to this customize and you can add additional codes or project elements in your Layout. The module creates a group map for each group by parameter you select in this group on sort by dialog box. And here in the layout bar, you can see the summarize, uh, summarizing bar for each WPS project EPS nodes. So if you group by other project node like division, you can as well see the summary for the project code. Now let's go to this, go back to this EPS. Now, how to fill up this project by project codes? You can create this custom filter here, right here. And you can add the design and you can mention the click this division is my project code and you can mention equal user defined. So right here you can see the user defined filter here. So if it is selected and click apply, 
can see the applicable because you can select the right filter. So if I select this, you will be getting the applicable filter here. So if I select all, I will be able to see all the project codes right here. So this is how we define the project codes, set up them and assign them to the projects and we use these project codes to organize your layouts by grouping and sorting and filtering. I hope you understood this video tutorial. In the next tutorial, we will be learning about user defined fields and how to work with these fields. I hope you understood this video tutorial. Please do subscribe for more upcoming videos. Thank you.